What am I standing around here for? I'm out of here! Naruto? I hear you've been real active on missions and such. Everyone in the village is talking about you. Hey, let's go somewhere and catch up. I'll buy you some Ichiraki ramen. No thanks. Naruto? field mission took forever. Oh, I wonder how everybody's doing. <laughs> It'll be great to see them all again. Hey, you two, settle down. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Well, we can't help it, Sensei. It's just been so long. Honestly. When I came back to the Hidden Leaf Village, Pervy Sage told me to settle down too, didn't he? pretty harsh, as always. We're just getting started. I'll increase the amount of difficulty little by little. <laughs> what? Why the laugh? Are you looking forward to more punishment? No, not that. I'm just glad to be training. Glad? It gets tougher every day, but when I think I'm getting closer to Sasuke, bit by bit, it just makes me happy. I'll get stronger and stronger. And I'll get Sasuke back for sure! Always cheerful with a positive attitude, huh? <laughs> Looking at you, I'm convinced that someday a bright light will shine into this world of ninja. Huh? Where's this coming from? Unfortunately, right now, the world is overrun by hatred. Hatred? It's a product of war, the grudge felt after something is lost. Orochimaru and Sasuke lost their families, and were trapped by hatred. 
they're also victims in a way. I'm always thinking that I want to do something about this hatred, but I'm not sure how to go about it yet. But I truly believe that the day will come when all people will understand one another and live in harmony. Wow, that's kind of deep. Well then, if I can't find the solution myself, shall I pass the quest on to you? Yes, sir. Can't refuse your orders, Pervy Sage. <laughs> What's so funny? I feel redeemed by your smiling face. <laughs> I'm glad I made you my student. Naruto. Iruka Sensei. I heard about Lord Jiraiya. I wanted him to keep watching over me. Wanted him to see me become Hokage. But I only ended up showing Pervy Sage the worst, most uncool side of me. I. Lord Jiraiya only ever had praise for you. He was always boasting about you, saying you were like his own grandchild. Hervey Sage? He had faith that you were the one who would inherit his will, that you would become a wonderful Hokage one day. So... Harvey Sage isn't here anymore. Even if he thought of me as his grandson, even if he believed I'd become Hokage, he isn't here anymore. He isn't anywhere anymore. He is. Huh? He's inside you, in your heart, and he'll always be watching over you. Inside me? It's true that Lord Jiraiya has left us, but the will you've inherited from him is still alive. In all that time you spent walking with Jiraiya, what did you receive? It was a countless amount of ideas, a will. That's what you inherited. That, Lord Jiraiya's will, is alive. It's firmly alive inside of you. Close your eyes. You should find Lord Jiraiya within you. For example, even if the same thing happens to you, I believe you'll keep going with your head up.
that your eyes will be clear, that you'll rush down the path you believe in. I'll always believe in you. Well, what did Lord Jiraiya say there inside you? Did he tell you to hesitate here and stay depressed? He... he didn't. He said he believed. Keep going with my head up. That I rushed down the path I believed in. He said he'd always believe in me. Did he? It's not like me to be depressed. He told me I could become Hokage. He said I was like his grandchild. If I stay depressed, Pervy Sage is gonna get mad at me. really hurts, and it's frustrating and hard, but, but I won't just stand around anymore. I'm through hesitating. I'm gonna be myself. I'm gonna take what Pervy Sage gave me and charge down my own ninja way. Pervy Sage's student to the very end. <laughs> now that's the Naruto Uzumaki I know. Do your best. Yeah. Thanks, Iruka Sensei. Chapter The Tale of Naruto Uzumaki.